one day somebody does something unspeakable to someone else, to someone you hardly knew, man, you do something about it, because you can. This story is brought to us from foxnews.com. Yeah, Fox News. I know, you, you got to pick the, the ones with the most information, and I know Fox News. Whenever, sometimes I'll say Fox News, and then I'll get at least one comment of somebody going, really? You're, you're, you're buying a story from Fox News or CNN or any of that? I know. I get it. But I don't want you guys applauding too loud at this story. Because a woman in New York City <clears throat> drove her car into a New York City police officer at a crime scene and admitted that was intentional, saying, F these cops, it's a lesson to him. Sahara Dula, who's 24, was driving her black Lexus the wrong way on the Upper East Side on Wednesday while high on marijuana, and she plowed into a police officer. Well, wow, boy. She said, I told the cop I wanted to go straight and he wouldn't move. So I hit him. I did it on purpose, she told the investigators. <laughs> she wanted to go. She said, F these cops. He wouldn't move. She screamed shortly after the incident, according to the documents. So after the incident happened and everything, she screamed, F these cops. He wouldn't move. I'm teaching him a lesson. Next time, get out the way, bitch. Move, bitch. Get out the way. I'm sorry. Anyway, a source told the New York Police, or the to source told the New York Post that Dula said, um, "F these cops. It's a lesson to him, and hopefully he doesn't want to be a cop anymore." <laughs> she said, "Hopefully he don't want to be a cop no more. Hopefully he's like, I know I'm done." Other officers rushed to the wounded cop as he was laying on the ground in pain. Uh, wow. He suffered a broken leg and bruising on multiple areas of his body. That's not good. I mean, I, I, you know, you know, I don't really want anybody to get hurt like that. Uh, I don't know. And maybe she's wrong. I mean, I'm not saying the cop was wrong. I'm not happy that he got hurt. I'm just saying this girl's cry cry. Dula was taken into custody and charged with first degree attempted assault. Attempted aggravated assault on a police officer, second degree assault, second degree reckless endangerment, and operating a motor vehicle while ability, ability impaired by drugs and reckless driving. Those are all her charges. I love the attempted assault. <laughs> she didn't attempt it. She just plowed through. Manhattan Assistant District Attorney Lucy Shepard said, uh, during Dula's arraignment in Manhattan Criminal Court, that she admitted to smoking marijuana. Marijuana and rolling papers were found in her car. Judge John Zuo Wang set her bail at $25,000, but she did not immediately make bail. <clears throat> um, now, the Police Benevolent Association, which is the union there in New York, President Patrick Hendry said why Dula is not facing an attempted murder charge is a good question. It's clear that she tried to mow down a New York City police officer. The criminal justice system is broken. Until these individuals are punished for assaulting New York City police officers, they're going to continue. He said, we're glad that this individual is being kept in jail. Well, she has a $25,000 bail. But we don't understand why she isn't being charged with attempted murder. This was a vicious attack. She intentionally tried to run over a New York City police officer. This leniency is why thousands of police officers are being assaulted and attacked on a daily basis. Well, that's not why, just so you know. But in this case, to get my moral of the story, my take, uh, yeah, I think she's wrong. I mean, you don't just run over people just because I want to go that way. She, yeah, she deserves some jail time. Now, Dula may have escaped an attempted murder charge because of questions about whether she intended to kill the cop. We don't know that she intended to kill him. That's right. She just intended to drive on. Her lawyer said she runs her own company where she mentors kids on Saturdays and attempts to help them stay off the streets 
and away from drugs and gangs. Kids, stay off the streets. Stay away from drugs. Okay, just use ganja. I don't know, I'm just saying. But um, maybe she should take her own advice. I don't know. I'm not going there. I'm not going to open that marijuana. But, um, you know, coming back to it, $25,000 bail for this woman who plowed into a cop with her car. But no bail for people in California who are protesting and are charged with assault of pepper spray, chemical pepper spray, and so forth, and maybe punching somebody. and. No bail for them. $25,000 bail for this lady who piled through a cop. You know, I don't know. Just saying.